everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel on the art of alopecia. For those who don't know me, my name is Marcy and I have an autoimmune condition called alopecia universalis. Basically what that means is my immune system mistakenly attacks my hair follicles and that is why I am completely bald and balding throughout my body. And on this YouTube channel, we talk all about hair loss. We primarily do wig reviews because they're my favorite, um, but I have done lots of tips, tricks, tutorials, Q and A's and all that fun stuff. Um, I am also very active on two other social media platforms on my TikTok and my Instagram. You can also find me under the name, The Art of Alopecia. And I also have um, an Art of Alopecia Gmail account that you can email me at any time if you have any questions, concerns, in need of support. Yeah, feel free to reach out to me via email. I just have that email um, for you guys. If you don't necessarily feel comfortable reaching out to me via social media, I can understand um, that privacy is a big thing. So feel free to email me um, whenever you'd like. But for today's video, I'm going to be doing yet another wig review. And this is a company that I have never tried out before, nor have I heard of until they reached out to me. Um, so I'm very happy that they did because this unit is gorgeous. Um, but the company is called Hair VV. So basically hair, V-I-V-I. -V -I. Um, I don't exactly know where they're based out of, um, but their online website, online boutique ships worldwide, which is fantastic. Um, but today I'm going to be reviewing their Vivian unit. So if you are interested in um, learning more about Hair VV and um, looking for a gorgeous, stunning blonde lace front, then keep watching. But first, before I show you guys the wig, you know me, I like to do a little unboxing and a little review of the box itself because as I always say in all of my videos, when you are investing in high quality wigs that are expensive, you wanna ensure that um, the storage is high quality as well. So this is the box. It was wrapped up in a cute little bow. Um, I did do an unboxing on my TikTok, tick on my TikTok, so feel free to check that out. It's just your regular box. Um, it's not overly sturdy, but it is quite sturdy for the most part. It's not a magnetic box. It's just one that you open up like a normal shoe box. And inside, obviously the wig was in here with um, the tissue paper inside and the netting around it, but they gave me a hair VV, a hair VV um, silk bag or satin, I wanna say, satin rose gold, which is gorgeous. And they gave me a hair VV comb. You can never have too many combs. And then they gave me a styling brush. Um, you would normally use this if you were gluing it down and wanted to create um, create some like baby hairs or really glue down the baby hairs. I have two clips, which are great because these come in handy when styling or putting your hair back and doing your makeup and stuff. They also sent me another Hair VV um, satin bag, which is great. I think this is what the um, accessories came in. And then there's just the box. So, so ultimately pretty good. You guys know that I love my free goodies and my satin silk bags. Ultimately pretty good. But let's get on to the real reason why you clicked on this video. I know you guys wanna see the wig. So introducing Miss Vivian. She is such a stunning blonde. Oh my goodness. I have my computer right in front of me that I'm gonna read the specs off of, off to you before, um, before I try her on. So her name is Vivian. She is a blonde highlighted wig. Um, her knots are bleached and she has a plucked hairline. Um, she is 180% in density and she is transparent lace. Um, I believe they sent me in a, I, I believe they sent me a small, small holds a 21.5 inch circumference. Um, so it is a tad big because I'm t usually 20, but they do have um, a small available and a medium size. 100% virgin human hair, obviously not virgin since um, she was probably dyed to create these gorgeous highlights. Um, she is 18 inches long, super long. Um, her cap construction um, is a 13 by six frontal lace. So the lace goes all the way back to the top of the head and then it's wefted at the back. 
and then you have your adjustment straps and your resistance band. You guys know that I love my resistance band. I have already cut the lace. Um, I haven't cut in the ear tabs yet, um, but I will probably do that later on. But yeah, this is the wig. She is stunning. Um, I am in front of the natural lighting, so this is what she looks like in front of a window. Um, she does have quite a lot of um, darkness to it, I would say, which is actually makes it look a lot more realistic. Bottom of the wig is so blonde, but then leading up to the root, it's more um, brown, which is great because it looks more natural. So yeah, this is the Vivian wig. Let's try her on. So first I'm going to fold the wig in half. I'm gonna put on the resistance band. Gotta tuck this in behind, flip her over. And there she is. Okay guys, let's get into this wig review. So off the bat, the color is the most gorgeous, stunning color I think I've ever seen in a wig form. It just has so many different dimensions of colors that makes it look so natural. It's like the root is so dark, but then it just melts into this stunning honey blonde. I am absolutely obsessed with the color. I'm brushing the hair and nothing seems to be coming out. So no shedding, fantastic. But the one thing that catches my eye is this lace. And I'm really, really sad about it. Um, so on the website, it states that it's HD transparent lace, which usually means that it's transparent on all different skin colors. Um, I have very fair skin. I am wearing some bronzer right now. Um, that's kind of usually part of my everyday makeup look. So I don't look like a ghost 24 um, seven. But this is just, it's not it. It's not working on my skin color. I think it would definitely melt into um, a skin color that's a little darker than mine. I think it would look very, very natural. Um, but for me, it's just, it's not cutting the mustard. I don't know if anyone has heard that saying. My mom started saying it, so now I'm saying it. Um, but let me just give you an up close. And as I said, the ear tabs are not cut yet. So if they were, I would cut them, I would hold them, and then I would cut probably that much off and then tuck it right behind my ear or cut it off. Depends on personal preference. Mm, this is like so unfortunate because I'm so obsessed with the color. I'm literally in awe about this wig. I just wish that the lace was more transparent. Uh, a lot of the time it's a struggle um, finding lace wigs when you have very fair skin like me um, because if the lace isn't guaranteed to be 100% transparent um, then we'll be able to see where the wig starts. It's like it's just so obvious on my white skin even if I put it on my finger like you can still see those knots which is like so sad but anyway I wouldn't recommend this wig to anyone with very fair skin like me, but I would recommend it to anyone who has um, a little bit darker skin. I think it would look absolutely spectacular on you. Um, but moving on to all of the other positives because there are so many. Um, so the cap construction is made pretty well. It's your, it's your basic average cap construction in terms of a front lace. So the lace sits about till here so you can part it wherever you'd like and you can like style French braids going up and it's supposed to um, look extremely realistic um, with the lace. You can't put it up into a high pony just because of the wefts at the back. But it is human hair and it is really soft human hair. I am running my fingers down the hair and there is close to no shedding, which is like a bonus. Um, but yeah, you can curl it, you can straighten it, you can style it however you like. You can put hot rollers in it, blow dry it. Um, there is so much versatility when it comes to human hair wigs, which is fantastic. It's my favorite. Um, that's 
why I will always choose human hair over synthetic is because you can curl them and you guys know how much I love to curl my wigs. I rarely go out with straight hair. I love to have a little bit of wave. Um, this did come curly at first, um, but over time it's kind of lost its curl. Oh, this color is so, so, so stunning. But in terms of the security and comfortability, uh, it's pretty comfortable for the most part. Um, secure, very secure with um, with the resistance band. The resistance band literally changes lives. I don't think you would have to um, glue it down or tape it down for a while. It is sitting very, very flat. Um, but over time, lace starts to curl and eventually you will have to start to tape it down. Um, but I think for the first few weeks, I think honestly, it will stay intact just like this, which is fantastic. Like I'm moving around and this lace is not curling, which is great. And these cute little baby hairs are there, which is great. So that will add a little bit more realism, which is great. I think to make it more realistic, I would bring it into a stylist and maybe get in some face framing layers. Um, but honestly, you don't really need it if you don't want to. This is just so gorgeous. I just wish that my skin wasn't so fair so that I could just feel super duper confident going out. Oh, see what I just did there? So I did like a little half up, half down. The, the lace did start to lift. Um, so if you are planning on just doing a half up, half down, I would just recommend putting two pieces of tape right on the ear tabs just to secure that. But I think as long as you're wearing it down, I don't think that you have to um, use any kind of adhesive to keep it intact, but oh my goodness. And it smells so good and I just wish it would work for me. I might, I might, I might end up keeping it and um, wearing like a cute winter hat or like a cute baseball hat on top. Um, oh, this is so sad. There's just so much good about it and I just wish the lace, anyway, I'm not gonna say it again because I've said it like so many times. The thing that absolutely gets me every time is when I look on their website and I look at the price of this wig. This wig is only $700 Canadian. For human hair, of this good quality, for this length, for this density, $700. In my eyes, when I see a wig like this, I would think at least $1,500 Canadian, but this is only $700. Kinda understand why it's $700, but I kinda also don't understand why it's $700. Like if I was selling this wig, I would probably sell it for around that Around that price, just because the lace isn't transparent, um, but the price is worth it if you have darker skin. Like even if you are a little, a few shades darker than me, oh my goodness, this is gonna look so amazing because the knots are just going to melt into your skin tone. It's just due to the fact that I'm so white. Just look at how stunning this is. <laughs> I'm so sad. It's like gorgeous color comfortable for the most part, fairly secure, $700. $700 Canadian. Like that is not a lot of money for this kind of wig. Like I would have expected it, expected it to be in the thousand range. Last thing I wanna say before I leave is if you do have a small size head, um, like mine, my head is 20 inches in circumference. Um, this is 21.5. It is a little bit too big for me. Um, the wefts do bunch up at the back, but that's only a concern if you are planning on wearing it like a half up, half down, because that's when the wefts start to come out. Um, but if you're just planning on wearing it down, then I don't think it would be an issue. It's very secure. It's just a matter of the wefts kind of sticking out a little bit because it's a bit too big. But other than that, guys, oh, there are so many pros to this wig and one simple con, which kind of, it doesn't ruin the wig. It just, it makes it quite disappointing for people with fair skin. But anyway, 
That is my full and honest review of the Vivian wig from Hair VV. I do have a discount code for you guys um, to use on the Hair VV website. So if you are interested in saving some money, be sure to use my code um, at checkout um, to save some money. I hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as I enjoyed filming it. Um, go check out Hair VV. They have lots and lots of um, selection on their website if you're looking for something of pretty high quality for something that's very, very affordable. Um, I would highly recommend going to check them out. I will link everything down below, um, so be sure to check them out. Um, but in the meantime, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, like this video if you enjoyed it, go follow me on all of my other social media platforms, and we will see you next time on The Art of Alicia. Bye guys!